nice and flaky. Hmm, so delicious. What's up guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna be making some bourbon glazed salmon. I'm also gonna be making some sauteed veggies on the side. So for the bourbon glazed salmon, you're gonna need four salmon fillets, about six ounces each, or you can do two like large salmon fillets, that's what I have. Kosher salt and black pepper to taste two large cloves of garlic, grated or minced, half a cup of brown sugar, one fourth cup plus two tablespoons of bourbon, one fourth cup of low sodium soy sauce, two green onions chopped, two tablespoons butter. So right now I have my veggies here. I'm just going to chop these up really quick. This is totally optional. I'll show you guys the process here. You guys are having a great day. Go ahead and start off with chopping our garlic. So we're just gonna mince the garlic really quick. This is for our bourbon glaze. I had to go grab the bourbon because I forgot to grab that. And you can use any bourbon that you have. I just have the Jim Beam. Simple. All right, let's mince this up really quick. I'm not gonna do it perfectly. I decided to mince three cloves because I like extra garlic. Uh-oh, my camera. My phone is acting weird. All right. That's good, that's good enough. Doesn't have to be perfect. All right, move this to the side. Now let's just chop our green onions. I'm going to chop all of these because I love green onions. Onions and garlic are like my favorite things. <laughs> Okay, so let's go ahead and chop these up. Yum. Smells so good. And I already washed the veggies, so I don't know if I said that or not. Okay, now I just have some broccoli. Just two heads of broccoli. I'm gonna cut off the um, stems. Don't want that. Just chop that up. Make sure the stems are off because broccoli is a lot easier to cook when the stems are removed. And I'm just going to just do a really quick and easy saute with these. Nothing fancy, just some olive oil, salt and pepper. I'm gonna put this on the side. Also gonna grab this one. Okay, gonna grab have a bowl to make our sauce. This little whisk, so that way we can make our bourbon glaze. So I just need to go to the fridge and grab my low sodium soy sauce because we're gonna need one fourth cup of that. I have the bourbon ready and have my brown sugar, kosher salt, black pepper. So for the veggies, I'm going to be sauteing the broccoli that you saw with some Baby Bella mushrooms. Throw away my trash, clean up as I go. Grab my low sodium soy sauce. So yeah, grab my soy sauce. Add and make our bourbon glaze. Make sure you guys are still there. Okay, so it says, in a small bowl, whisk together the Garlic, brown sugar, bourbon, soy sauce, and green onions. Okay, so we're gonna save some green onions for our garnish. We're gonna garnish the, the salmon with some green onions, and then we're also going to add the two green onions into the sauce. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get you guys set up here. You're gonna need a um, cast iron skillet. Oopsie. Grab my... skillet and we're gonna put this away and then I'm gonna grab a tablespoon measurement. Put this here. That'll like my kids. 
candle. One fourth cup bourbon plus two tablespoons. Yum. <laughs> Let's do the two tablespoons first. Boom. Oh. Boom. <laughs> and then one fourth cup. Just like that. I'm just going to put this away. And then we need one fourth cup low sodium soy sauce. One fourth cup low sodium soy sauce. Okay, and now we have our brown sugar. Okay. And what else? <sighs> garlic, brown sugar, bourbon, soy sauce, green onion. Okay, we're just missing the garlic and the green onion. So I'm gonna grab the um, garlic and like a handful of green onions. But remember, you can save some green onions for the garnish if you want. So yeah. Just do, I'm gonna do a little bit more. Perfect. And then we're just going to add the garlic. Perfect. Now we're just gonna whisk it together until it's evenly distributed. <laughs> I love saying that. Okay. Ooh! Need to be careful. Oh yeah, it's getting nice and thick. Perfect. Perfect, that's good. Definitely smell the bourbon. Okay, that is good. We're gonna put that aside. And then, what else? What else does it say? Okay, so we're gonna be cooking this, this bourbon glaze. And we're gonna be whisking it constantly for like one to two minutes over medium high heat. Someone was screaming outside of my apartment. We're gonna whisk this sauce. We're gonna cook it for three minutes. Let me grab my salmon too, I'll show you. So yeah, two large pieces of salmon. The salmon, some salt, kosher salt and some black pepper. I do like half a teaspoon. And we are going to go over there and cook our bourbon glaze. Put this away, put this back in the fridge. And then, gotta get a pan for our vegetables as well. Skillet for our veggies. Over here. Some salt and pepper on our salmon. Over there and we're going to cook our sauce. Whisk it constantly so that way the, the sauce cooks well but it doesn't burn. Medium heat and then to our skillet. Whisk it for about two to three minutes. Yeah, it's already starting to get thicker. Okay guys, so the sauce is starting to boil a little bit, so I'm turning the heat down just a tad. Bubbling up a little bit, we're gonna add our salmon skin side down, and we're going to baste the salmon with a spoon, making sure that we put the sauce on the top. Add our salmon. Our skillet. Make sure we get all of the sauce on the top because we want the salmon to really absorb our glaze. And the sauce is smelling super delicious. Hey guys, so I forgot to add our two tablespoons of butter to the skillet, but we can go ahead and do that right now. I don't see why not. So let's go ahead and add our butter, but originally the recipe said to add the butter to the skillet first. But I'll just add the butter right now. So, butter is going in. 
Okay you guys, since we cooked our salmon a little bit on a low medium heat with our bourbon glaze, now we're going to transfer our oven safe skillet, AKA the cast iron skillet, into the oven. We're gonna broil that for five to six minutes and we're gonna baste it, baste it halfway through so that way the salmon gets caramelized on the top. So that's what we're gonna do. My oven is on, gonna broil it, and then I'm also going to make our sauteed veggies. And if you're doing that as well, I'm just using some olive oil, salt and pepper, nothing fancy, and I'm just going to cook that up really quick. Some black pepper and kosher salt for my broccoli and mushrooms. I just washed the mushrooms, so our vegetables are all washed. And I'm just going to add a drizzle of olive oil to our skillet, cook those until they're, um, till they're tender. So medium high heat. And then we're about to add our salmon into our broiler for five to six minutes. Drizzle about two tablespoons of olive oil. Add our broccoli. Just gonna add that first and then I'll add the mushrooms in a few minutes. Kosher salt, pepper. A little bit more olive oil. Let's go ahead and add our mushrooms. Really nicely, so it gets coated with the oil and the salt. And I'm gonna turn it down to a medium heat. Go ahead and add our salmon into our broiler for five to six minutes. So I took the salmon out. It's about halfway through right now. I'm just going to baste the salmon and then put it back in and let it boil until it's completely finished. Salmon with the sauce and make sure it gets super caramelized on the top. The sauce to the top of the salmon. For a few more minutes. The salmon is done and it looks so delicious. have my bourbon glazed salmon with sauteed vegetables. Just have some water. I'm gonna add a few more green onions to the top because I love green onions. So let's go ahead and try this out. Ooh yeah, perfectly cooked. Nice and flaky, but I can tell it's really well done. Mmm, so delicious, tender, yep, that's good, mm-hmm, wow, yeah, I took the skin off because I don't like the skin of salmon, too fishy, but that is beautiful, right? Mmm. It has been too long since I've had salmon. Salmon is my favorite fish for sure. And it's so good for you. Mm-hmm. The bourbon glaze. Mm, it's sweet. Tangy. It is so good. Garlicky. Mm hmm. Perfect dinner. And the mushrooms and the broccoli are perfectly cooked. Just simple, you know. Simple broccoli, nothing fancy. But definitely wanted something healthy today. Mm -hmm.
water. <clears throat> Just water. Mushrooms are just so good. Cooked mushrooms. This salmon is really good. It's cooked perfectly. They're thick pieces too. Got them at Walmart. I know at Costco, you can get like really big um, fillets of salmon for like super cheap but Walmart wasn't too bad today as far as the price mm -hmm. and the green onion so good I wish I could share. I do, I wish I could share with you. Trimmer cut out, I wasn't even paying attention. But I was saying, salmon is just so good for you, like for your overall health. It's good for your hair, your skin, your heart, your memory. bites left I used to eat salmon like five days a week <laughs> I miss it I'm pretty full watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.